something that I need Yeah, I need, ooh, ooh You got something that I need Yeah, I need, ooh, ooh Take me somewhere far away from Yeah, I mic myself Okay, good morning everyone. Welcome back to Target Transfers. So I'm currently in our showroom, the Heat Printing Innovation Center, um, and I'm looking at something very exciting. These are the final mock-ups of our new podcast clothing collection. So exciting. Um, this is something that Andy and I have been talking about doing since we started the podcast. Um, as much as we love our black and white print t-shirts. They are a little bit boring and don't really um, represent sort of who we are as a brand or where we want the podcast to go. Um, so yeah, we put together a few edgy retail style um, designs. So stage one of the process was to basically pick out the staples for the collection. So we picked three to four different color tees and sweats that we wanted to be like our staples. And then we worked the designs around that. So as you can see, I've got the garments that we've chosen on the rail behind me. So we've gone very sort of minimalist neutral vibes with a bit of pop of color in there. So we've got our uh, Bella canvas hoods in here. We've got our all we do is just hoods. We've got some oversized tees, long sleeve tees standard t-shirts which are on the table in front of me so yeah we've gone really really high quality sustainable garments yeah so there's a nice variety in there but they're all going to come together to be um quite recognizable within each other uh, across the final collection so from there we then pulled some inspiration pictures of roughly what we wanted our designs to look like and then from there i brought in our studio team who are the wonderful people that get all of your designs ready to be made into transfers when you send them in via easy view today we are finishing the final drafts of our designs we're going to mock them up in photoshop and illustrator onto the uh, pdfs of the actual garment pictures um, just to see what they'll look like in final print because this is not final print and it's taken quite a few weeks to get here as well So with picking the color garments making sure they're okay working out the sizing the colors of the prints we want um, And we're going to be using all three ultra color ultra color max and screen print transfers for this for a few different reasons That we'll touch on later on in this video series I'm just gonna go ahead into studio and we're gonna finish up the designs for the collection um, and then hopefully we can get them sent to print So we're going to order our first set of transfer samples. I'm on easy view at the moment, as you can see, this is how we order all of our custom heat transfers. It's all done online. So I'm just gonna select Ultra Color Max because this is the order minimum of one option. So scroll down and select the option. And then I'm gonna click add design. And then I'm going to upload my image. Here it is. And it will take a second just to load into the platform. Okay, so now the design has loaded into the platform, we're just going to scroll down and it asks you if you own the right to these images, which we've just designed them all from scratch, so we do. And then it will load it in to the designer. Now obviously it says here if the quality is good enough um, for print, which is it's green, so that's really good. So we've opted to print a couple of different uh, logos from each garment that we're going to be decorating. Um, so I'm just going to come over here. We're only gonna order one because this is a test sample and it's the 29 pounds. I'm just gonna add that to my basket and check out. And then once they're printed, they'll be ready and with us in two days and we can test out our first samples. Okay, so we've just had the test order through for our Ultra Color Max transfers. Now the reason that we've used Ultra Color Max first is to check the colors of the design, the size of them, if they work on the color garments that we want to use. Uh, so what we've done is create two different gang sheets with all of the designs on so as you can see we've got a few for the front there's the big back print a few of the plainer ones so that was the first one and then also on this sheet I just wanted to point out we had some extra space on here so as you can see we've done 
uh, the pink and yellow prints for the podcast on the top. But then we had sort of half a sheet left over from what we needed to print. So we just put some Target logos on there, some big and small ones, which we needed for some other things. So even though they're not for the same order, they're not even for the same job, they can all be put on the same sheet to maximize the cost of Ultramax DTF sheets. So yes, very, very efficient way to add in some extra transfers if you need them on your order and you've got some extra space. We're just going to cut these up now, fuse them on a few of the test garments, make sure they're the right size. Uh, and then yeah, hopefully we can order our main prints. I'm seeing the samples, Andy, for our podcast collection. What do you think? They look fantastic. They look really good. The colours have come out really nicely. They look great on this. This Bella Canvas, is it? Yeah, that yeah. one's Bella Canvas. Yeah. Yeah, those gradients look amazing, don't they? I'm really, really pleased with how they've come out. Nice arm print there as well. Very, very good. Excited to see the final prints yeah, next week. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, and then those colours look pop really nicely on the darks as well, don't they? I think it's really, really great. I think I might fuse that one, um, if you turn around, I might fuse it up a bit more. I think it needs to be yeah. a bit higher on the shirt. Yeah, you, could, you can get away with it because it's not got the hood on there. You can go higher with that one if you want to. Yeah. That won't be a problem. Cool. Are you excited? I'm so excited. The first one. Oh my God, no way. It looks good, doesn't it? <gasps> That looks so good. I did That's them a bit small, because so well. when I opened them in Photoshop, they looked massive. Yeah, but we will do. But we did size them right, no, so, I, so when good. we did the actual this order. So... That's come out so well. The colors on them are so good. Turn it over. Oh my God. <gasps> my How <yeah>. good is it? <laughs> It amazing. looks amazing. I'm really glad we went with this mic yes. and not the other one. Oh, it looks so much better than the other one, oh my God. Yeah, the detail was just crazy. This one is just the oh, grey yeah, and nice. black. I did debate doing it on the other grey, but it was yeah. a bit too light no, for what no, it was. No, I think it goes. No, it does look good, I like it. This one, I did muck up the fusing on the back of this one because I had to <laughs> cut it and <laughs> oh then it God. moved. Oh it's not that God. bad, but it's not final. So this is the front. Cute. Which looks yes. good, right? I love it. The sleeves look great, so we've got the oh, established. Yes. that's such a good size. And then this one has, um, the podcast yeah, one, amazing. which looks great. Yeah, that looks so good. And then the back looks incredible. Yeah. Let's take those off you. But in terms of the print and the size. No, that does look good. The colors look so good as well. I'm so happy with it's that. It's so soft. Because this well. was the one as well that we were very like skeptical about. Yeah. That's my so favorite good. one. No, I really I know like that. This was that is one of these one. That, two yeah, are they're definitely they're the, the favorite. <laughs> <laughs> No, they I look just, cute. I just love it. You did a great job. Oh, These are yours. I know. What oh, do we think, Katie? Good. Amazing. Ten out of ten. Ten out of ten. Always. <laughs> All I want is you.